guys welcome back to my channel you are highly welcome guys first of all let me thank you guys you guys are mwah. thank you so much i love you all thank you guys for being there for me thank you for always watching my video you guys have uh, short I, I don't know what to say but thank you my god will bless all of you for me okay guys today i want to take you guys along with me and show you how i make this lovely afan soup that you are seeing now so let's go to the kitchen and you will see how i came up with this lovely afan soup that you are seeing i will show you all the ingredients that i use to cook this lovely afan soup so guys please don't go stay with me let's cook this soup wash it till end please guys don't go because i want to eat this food with you guys when we finish cooking the soup so guys let's go down to the kitchen and start preparing this soup and now i'm going to take you guys to the kitchen and show you all the ingredients i'm going to use to make this soup so guys let's go so guys these are all the ingredients i'm going to use to cook the afan soup this is my aromat this is my asam periwinkle these chopped onions and this is my blended pepper crayfish onions um, dawa dawa and hot pepper that's what i've already blended here together and this is my meat. I have tripe, which is uh, shaki, and cow skin, which is thick pomo. And this is my smoked turkey. And over here is my red oil. And this is my cat fillet fish that I'm going to use. And this meat is my goat meat and um, hot steel. And this is stock fish. Over there is vegetable, which is spinach and water leaf. I mix two of them together because the water leaf is not much. So I mix with it a fresh and spinach. And that's my blended okazi, which is half and leaf. So these are all the things I'm going to use to prepare the half and soup now. So we're going down now to start preparing the soup. So guys, let's dive into the cooking. Okay guys. So I'm going to start with the stock fish first. And the shaki and thick mama. The water that came out from the blender. This water is the water I use in blending my okazi leaf. I like using it to boil my meat because it has the slimy taste that water leaf give because I'm using spinach. So okazi is a little bit slimy also. So when I blend my okazi, I like to use the water to cook my meat. So that's why I'm using the water. I'm adding my Maggi to which is four. I'm going to cover it and allow it to cook for 10 minutes. So I'm going to leave it for 10 minutes to cook before I add the other meat. Okay guys, so after 10 minutes, I've opened the meat, I'm going to add the rest of the meat. Okay. So, adding a bit of the crisp, um, onions. Onions. One more, no cube. 
I'm stirring it now. Because I'm adding the dry fish because it's hot. I'm covering it now for the next 15 minutes, okay? So after 15 minutes, this meat has cooked well and I've turned it over to this pot that I'm going to use to cook the soup. So now I'm adding my blended pepper, crayfish, dawa dawa and onions. I'm going to cover it for five minutes to cook. So after five minutes, the soup is now cooking. I'm going to add the oil now. Now if I eat a lot of oil. I'm going to add the periwinkle. I'm adding the periwinkle. Good. So I'm adding the smoked turkey now. So after adding the turkey, I'm going to cover it to cook for five minutes. minutes so after five minutes i'm going to add the spinach and water leaf first so i'm going to add the rest of the onions in now i've used half of it and cooked the meat so the remaining half i'm putting it in now so after adding the onions i'm going to stir it before I will now cover it just to cook for five minutes before adding the okazi leaf. After five minutes, so after five minutes now, I'm going to stir it properly after stirring it then i'm going to add the afan leaf now so i'm adding the afan now and after that i'm going to cover it and allow it to cook for 10 minutes I'm going to add more oil so I've added more oil because as I said at the beginning Afan soup need a lot of oil so that's why I'm still adding another oil on it to make it to come up very well so after adding the oil now I'm going to stir it properly and stir make sure that they all mix prop very well so after staying it now i'm going to cover it and i'm going to allow it to cook for 10 minutes so after 10 minutes i will now open it and test it i know if there is anything i still need to add on it so i'm covering it now for 10 minutes so after 10 minutes i'm back and I'm going to stir the soup properly. After stirring it, I'm going to add my hunger seasoning. So after adding the hunger seasoning, I'm going to stir it properly. After stirring it properly, then I'm going to give it a taste. So I'm going to taste the soup now. 
and I need to add a little bit aromat. After that, I'm going to stir it once again. And after stirring it, I will now give it another taste. So, after testing it down, I'm going to cover it for five minutes. And after five minutes, the soup is done. So, guys, after five minutes now, the soup, I'm going to give it a stir and test again. Good. The soup, everything has entered inside the soup. So I'm going to stay it properly now. And guys, look at it. The soup is ready. Ready to serve. So guys, just watch and look and see how my Afan soup look like. So this is all the ingredients put together. You can see the result of it. Thank you guys. Thank you for watching my video. Thank you for being there for me. I so much appreciate you guys. Thank you so much. So guys, I'm going to serve the soup now. Because you can see that the soup is ready to serve. Because I can't wait to eat this soup. This is 4 o'clock. I haven't eaten all day because of I'm waiting for this soup. So I'm serving the soup now for me to go down and enjoy my afan soup guy right? you can come and enjoy with me uh -huh. so you are invited come and let's eat okay guys so watch my afan soup guy right? can you see this soup this is how i made my afan soup guys give it a try let me know in the comment section how the soup look like when you give it a when you try it and let me know okay guys so thank you guys for watching i'll see you guys in my next video i appreciate you guys so much for being there for me thank you guys thank you so much see you in my next video i love you all bye bye